Hello guys, this is Sammy from HackerBad.net and welcome to my advanced tutorial on how to use Cheat Engine to cheat in video games. Today we're going to have a look at Speed Hacks. Now, Speed Hacks are quite useful because they allow us to slow down a game such as this one. And yeah, that really allows us to perform a lot better in most games because yeah, you need reflexes, you need to press buttons really fast and all that kind of stuff. You need to dodge stuff and aim and shoot and yeah, all the, the good stuff, you know. So. This is especially useful if all the other kind of messes up we have already discussed don't work or to complement those if they work. Now if you haven't already then I would recommend that you watch the other videos in this series because well it kind of builds up you know you need the knowledge that you gained from those videos in order to do this. So. As you um, have already done, you have uh, selected your process that you want to hack. Now, how it basically works is you start your game or whatever, and you can go into Cheat Engine. Actually, I should, I'm dying right here. Uh, okay, that's not so good. So, you go into Cheat Engine, <laughs> and I, I'm dead now, but well, whatever. So, and you enable a speed hack right here, okay? You just uh, press this little, uh, you just enable the checkbox right here. And now you can set your speed hack to, for example, 0.5, okay? So this is one way of doing it. And then you just press apply. And that will basically take care of it, okay? So as you can see, now everything should theoretically be half the speed that it used to be. And yeah, it is. As you can see, it's really slow, really, really slow. And yeah, I'm still gonna die because I'm still bad at this. But yeah, it, that's not the point point is that it works. Now, if I disable this, it's going to be normal speed again. Now, there's a better way of doing this because it's kind of annoying if you always have to go and enable speed hack and set it and it's, it, it, there's an easier way. So you go to edit, settings, and then you go to hotkeys, okay? And here you can set speed hack hotkeys. Uh, yeah, speed hack hotkeys. Now, speed hack hotkeys. Sorry, it's really hard to pronounce it. Now, here you can set a hotkey and associate it with a speed, okay? One being normal speed, uh, everything above one being faster than normal, two being obviously um, twice the, the normal speed, and yeah, everything below one being slower. Now open files is obviously half speed. I have set the hotkey O for half the speed, I've set 9 for um, normal speed, and I've set 3, uh, actually I've set 8 for freezing the game, okay? So you can uh, map this to any hotkey you want, doesn't really matter. Uh, important is that you do have a hotkey for going back to normal because uh, in some games it can be, you know, if you, you have cutscenes for example in a game and you have to watch the cutscene in uh, let's say 0.5 uh, the normal speed, you know, um, that's kind of annoying because it's boring and it doesn't make sense. So yeah, just gonna demonstrate this real quick. Uh, just have to remember my hotkeys. Oh, nine at eight. Okay, yeah, that should do it. Okay, so I'm just gonna do this real quick. Um, try again, whatever. So my O key will make my, will, will make it go half speed. So which there you go, half speed. Now I think my nine should make it go back to normal. Yes, that's that's correct. And my Eight freezes the game. So, ah, oh, that's kind of awesome. Actually, freezing the game in some situation is quite awesome as well. So, just going back to half the speed, which allows me to really dodge the lasers and stuff. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it would actually allow me to dodge, but yeah, I'm bad at this. Whatever. So it works. Um, these hotkeys are the way I see it, the best method of doing this. But you are obviously free to do it however you want. Um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want some more, just let me know by commenting, liking, or whatever. And yeah, speed hacks are really a... For me, it's kind of something that I always use. It works for about 95% of all games. There are some games that will crash once you try and activate a speed hack. Yeah, it's speed hack, but um, those are really rare, really, really rare. I mean, I, I hack a lot of games and yeah, about in a year I get about three or maybe four games that will crash when activating a speed hack, okay? And I'm, I'm hacking, I'm hacking a lot of games, so um, it's really a, a, a small percentage of games that, for which that will not work. Alright, yeah, see you guys soon on HackerBot.net and God bless you.